Hello everyone, welcome back yet again. Alright, so what did we do last time? Well, we went to Elam. I built a new lightsaber. And then we're now we're back to uh, Dathomir to face... Is it Taran? Talon? I think it's Taran. Taran Malakos. And to kill zombies, of course. Mainly to kill zombies and uh, fight an evil Jedi. Oh god, uh, there you go. Oh god, wow. these, these things are not easy to kill. Well, as I'm making my way to the temple, if you guys could leave a like for the video, uh, leave a comment down below, and if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button. That would be brilliant. What the hell? Yeah, it just occurred to me that I haven't actually bought the um a uh, lightsaber. Oh god! No! Oh god! Ah, you son of a bitch! Yeah, I haven't bought the lightsaber mastery thing. Ah uh ha! -huh, you were too late. Oh look, more bounty hunters. There's always a bounty hunter here at this exact moment. Who's this now? You're nothing compared to me, Jedi. Here it comes. Take it off. He's quick, huh? Another. Oh, come on. Can't stop them all. Oh, he's bleeding. Come on, I'll oh, just one more hit. That's all it will take. Oh god. Dodge this! It's nothing! <laughs> Alright. Is that like a bumpy hunter droid? Take a look. Axion Brood. P pump the hunter droid. Alright. <laughs> Time to have a little retry, I think. And see how this goes. Okay, is there any more skills I can get for just one point? Yes, there is. Cool. Master. 
Not unarmed. You think that lightsaber proves you a Jedi? No. Facing you. Memories that have haunted me since Bracca. I won't run from them anymore. Then let us see what manner of death your courage brings. He doesn't seem very much like a Jedi. And we got a dark Jedi to defeat. I also found out as well that's not like a fingerless glove. The reason that's there is because that's the climbing gear. I think. I'm not sure. 100 percent You chose to return. Brave. But not wise. Maybe. Marin, right? I'm Cal Kestis. What you were told about the Jedi was not true. So you say, Cal. Malikos said many things too. Terra Malikos might have been part of my order, but what he is now, I... I have no idea. All I do know is having a lightsaber isn't what makes you a Jedi. Then what does? We were peacekeepers. We were betrayed by those we protected. Hunted down by the Empire, I... I might be one of the last of my kind. I was only a child when they attacked. An armored warrior brandishing this descended upon us and cut down my people, my sisters. Until I was left alone with the dead. Then Malikos came and promised me revenge if I shared our secrets with him in return. I know what it's like to lose everything. And Malikos was wrong to use that against you. We don't have to be enemies. We will need this. There she goes again. I'll be watching. Let's get out of here. Yeah, I read somewhere as well. Um, Malikos lies ahead. You could turn back. I can't. Lives are at stake. Whose lives? Innocents. Four sensitive children who will be hunted down and murdered. As we were. Yeah, I read some. Uh, now that yeah, My friend, that's done. I have never been one to shy away from the pursuit of knowledge. Yeah, this does not bode well, does it? These statues, if they are statues, they're not just like corpses turned to stone or something. Uh, yeah. By the way, um, in regards to what she said just now, an armored warrior brandishing a lightsaber, I read somewhere that that was uh, General Grievous, maybe? Um, I don't know if there's an episode of The Clone Wars where he does that, where he comes to Dathomir and wipes out the Night Sisters, or 
it could be that the that's an episode coming up in the new series, like in the new series, if there hasn't been an episode like that already, because I know the there's a last season of Clone Wars coming out on Disney Plus sometime next month, maybe. No, end of this month, end of February. Now, Kestis, Malakos, welcome home. Need to begin your training. What in these ruins tempts you so much to risk death? I could ask you the same thing. There is power there. Beyond Jedi understanding. Power I control. I would offer you the same thing. Don't you understand? I'm not interested in power. I want to restore the Order. Restore the Jedi Order? Poor fool. It's over! Jedi fell long before the Purge. We were stifled by tradition. Deafened by our past glories. Blinded by endless war. Maybe. But it's never over, Malakos. We stand here now, with the chance to learn. To rebuild from our mistakes. Jedi learn. There's no future for them. Why can you not see that? It's time for something new. You and me. We could build something different. Something better. No. And Dathomir will be your grave! That is quite a jarring change in quality, isn't it, from the cutscene? To seeing what he looks like, <laughs> you know, in in the game engine. Oh, come on. No! A little help, bud. <laughs> come on! You only delay the You're not dead yet. 
I'd say this is more of a better fight than the actual end fight for the game. Decent defense. Not too quickly. Oh, you're a quick one. Oh my god. Buddy, help! Uh, cool. Low help, bud. Dodging won't save you. <laughs> Blocking won't help. Try that again. All right. What is this? It's like you said, Malikosi. Dothamir will be your grave. No. Let him lie in the dark with his secrets until death takes him. Why'd you help me? To rid Dothamir of that parasite. Makes sense. What are you really doing here, Cal Kestis? The ones who built this tomb, the Zepho, they created an object called the Astrium. It opens a vault on a distant planet. Inside is a list of four sensitive children across the galaxy. But the Empire is looking for it too. What Empire? The Empire. The one bent on exterminating four sensitives so no one can stand against it. Then it will come for Dothamir before long, as the war did. I will help you find this Astrium. Thank you for helping me with Malikos. I thought I was a goner for a minute. Yes, you would have died. Right. I am glad you didn't. It is nice to have an ally. Yeah, I like the sound of that. You're welcome, Cal. I sense love interest in a future game. <laughs> yeah. Just a you know, random guess I've pulled out of the ether. That's another thing as well. Place. You get allies. Because this is pretty late in the game. We to be getting allies. So yeah. You don't really know much about her, so I assume that's going to be more thing for like the next game and the game after, maybe. But she helps you like a little bit towards the end and then that's it. Uh. I'm guessing this guy didn't, you know, have the time to set up all the traps and tunnels and intricate pieces of crap that all the other tombs had. He's just like, nope, straight line, and you get what you came for. And I don't you beat around the it. bush. It is real. Baron, this could be the key to the next generation of Jedi. I'm happy for you. And your Jedi. But nothing can bring back my people.
After the purge, I was alone for a, a long time. In hiding, I was, I was scared that they'd find out who I was or what I was. What changed? A very good friend of mine told me to go out and find my place in the galaxy. And you listen? Well, no. But life has this funny way of forcing you on the path forward anyway. Now here I am. Or at least expected. A path forward. I will join you. You will? I've spent years waiting for a chance to avenge my sisters. I'm finished waiting. I wish to fight by your side. Night sisters and Jedi do not travel together, but survivors, we adapt. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we do. What do you think, BD? I agree. My crew, they might take a little bit of convincing, though. Then we'll convince them. Yeah, that's, that always sounds a bit sinister coming from someone who looks like that. They'll need some convincing. Then we'll convince them. Wow, things got bright then all of a sudden. Is she gonna say anything? There's no way forward. There is now. Did you race the ones before too? I did. I wanted to see how you would handle Malikos. You were testing me? And you passed. Congratulations. Are you gonna help me with this? And through I go. This woman you travel with. Who is she? Seer? Wait, how do you know about her? I have seen your companions. Marikos wanted me to attack them, but they posed no threat. Seer, um... Well, she used to be a Jedi. It's a long story. I would like to know. Hmm. Should I not have walked into her? I'll meet you at your ship. Back to the ship. Yeah, you think the you know least she could have done would be get rid of the zombies, not just leave them wandering around the planet. Maybe she has. Let's find out. Nope. Zombies are still here. What a bitch. Oh, I did it again. Oh well. Oh god. No, oh, no. Mind help me out? Oh yeah. Nice throw, BD. Force push. Yeah, I think every time we leave this planet, there should be the animation should include like those zombie witches dangling from the underside of the ship. Anything other than that, and you know, it's unacceptable. You found it. Oh, well, who's this? What's that supposed to mean? 
It means I'll be joining you. Seer, Grease, this is Marin. She's a witch, isn't she? A night sister. Your fear is unnecessary. I couldn't have gotten the Astrium without her. We fought Malakos together. I trust her. And we trust you. You will have to earn it. Okay, fine. Grab some seat. Don't even try anything funny. Welcome aboard. They like you. I don't know what you're saying. Ah, that's cute. Let's talk later, Cal. Nope, can't talk to her. Let's grease. Where is Grease? Uh, uh, he's up here. If you're not ready to leave, don't bother me. Talkative bunch. I think that's the other thing as well. Um, this game's missing. It's that whole sort of Bioware approach where you can sort of talk to your, talk to the crew and get to know them a bit better. I think that game, this game, is kind of lacking in that regard as well. Like, w why bother putting the option to chat, like making that an option, if whenever you go to talk to someone, most of the time they're just going, "Yeah, we don't have time to chat," or "Don't bother me until this happens," or whatever. Because you only really talk to them a handful of times. You can just do that in a cutscene, couldn't you? But my meditation helps me focus out many distractions. I don't know. It's not a normal sound the mantis makes. Sounded like it came from inside, too. Like a stowaway? <laughs> They'd have to be pretty small, Grease. This ship isn't that big. Maybe. Or it could be. I have been missing some food lately. Smell. Oh, the droid smell? Not that I'm aware of. And they definitely don't eat. Uh, all right, I'll do more investigating. If I find something, I'll let you know. Can't wait. Hmm. Can't wait. Hmm. All right, right. kids, sit down. We're here. Well, you see, that's not. I may mention this. I may mention this before. I may mention a lot of things before. But yeah, <coughs> I do like that as like a sort of loading time to load up the next area. Just sort of go into hyperspace, and then you can explore the ship. For Cordova. You can make a joke. She's right. Oh, hey, is anybody hungry? I, I was thinking of whipping up some scas steaks. I'm sorry, am I interrupting? No, Captain. And we couldn't have gotten this far without you. Oh, <laughs> well, it's, it's true, Grease. Thank you. Hey, I hope you get in there and you find that hollow thing. Holocron. Are you sure it's something you should find? What do you mean? The children on that list. If you take them from their homes to train as Jedi, won't they be hunted like you? It has to be kept out of the hands of the Empire. It'll help us put an end to the Empire. Oh, hey, uh, change of plans, we're arriving. Oh, Grease. <laughs> yeah? I take my steak rare. Huh? <sighs> huh? Okay. Now we're cooking! Well that is actually a cool animation, I really like that. When you find a hyperspace and the planet just comes out of nowhere. Right, well, I am going to call it quits here, because <coughs> I have a lot of editing to do. Uh, you might not hear it if I do a decent job editing the commentary, but there is pretty much like a storm raging outside. And when I look at the uh, audio track now as I'm recording, it's just a lot of background noise, like more than 
normal. So I assume the microphone's picking up the wind outside. So yeah, I'm going to be editing that for a bit, I think. Hopefully I do a good job, though. I uh, hope you enjoy the, uh, enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoy the commentary as well. Hope it's been a little bit informative. Uh, there's been one or two, like, Easter eggs in this one. Um, if you wait for the end screen as well, there'll be stuff on there you might like. Uh, you know, on my channel. If you could leave a like, comment, and subscribe, that would be perfect. For now, though, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.